Hello YouTube and welcome to, uh, to the first unboxing video for Super Gaming Dwarf with yours truly, Epic Boss. Now since it's our first unboxing video, we're going to review uh, something rather special. It's the Razer Naga Epic. Now this is a very expensive mouse, $150. I actually bought it for more expensive, but who cares. Now this thing has 17 uh, buttons on it. It has 12 on the sides, 2 on the middle, the regular buttons, and, you know, the scroll. The scroll button. Now, this thing, it could go wireless or cord. It's your decision. I kind of personally like to go wireless when I'm browsing the net and everything. And if I want to, to play, start gaming, do some serious gaming, uh, play World of Warcraft, Skyrim, <laughs> even Minecraft, I I use the cord. Now let's start. So over here you see, take it off. And wow. Let's, let's take it. Let me just put the camera here. It comes with a rather cool box. As you can see it has a few cool lines here. Now, in this box, wait, uh, oh my god, this is rather embarrassing. In this box, the first thing you'll see is the Razer Naga Epic itself. Now, this is a beauty. Look at it, look at it. Now, on the side here, it has three adjustable grips, one large, one medium, and one small. Over here, we have the wireless. Rather cool, all right. Now let's just put it here and let me show you something else. Let's see if there's anything under it. Yep, there is. Okay. Here is a CD and all the you know manual. Actually, I think it comes with two stickers, two free stickers, which I'm looking forward to see. Oh, and these, these are kind of like. You put them on the grip if you're uh, on the three on the on the buttons here. If you're having trouble with the grip, you know, only for a while. You could re you could remove them whenever you want. Oh, here we go. Here's the stickers. Best part. Totally worth uh, 150 dollars. Now here we have the manual. Here is telling us about you know how to join the community. Here's the language manual. And there's supposed to be a CD here. Hmm, I guess not. And here's, wow, this here's a second manual. Wait, let me see the other one. Wow, two manuals in one. Damn, I guess they forgot. And, wow, okay. Let's go. There's, now, there's a hitting thing. I was actually uh, almost forgot. Take it out. And here is the cord. Here we find the cord and everything. Here's the adjustable grips. Here's, uh, I think this is the medium. The large is already put on it. And here's the small. And for the wireless, we have the battery, which is over here. And the cord. I think this is pretty much it. So let me just pause this video and let me. Sh I'll show you some gameplay. Hello YouTube, and we are back now with some real gaming. See here, I've got it all set up to my computer. See, box is out. All set to my computer. Now I won't show you my computer really because you know that's uh, that's a surprise. Now, over here we got the recharger. While you're putting recharge, while you're recharging it, it'll keep on changing colors. If it's not changing colors, that means your battery is not connected properly. Now, I'm gonna st I'm gonna use it to play wireless with it, honestly, because I I'm not really you know in the mood to go uh, wired because you know it's a lot more quicker and everything. I'm just gonna start gaming like wireless. Of course, I know that's not the proper way for me, but I'm gonna do that. So let's take it. 
Okay, so now we're start. We're gonna start with Minecraft since it's our main game, the game we play the most. So you see me? I'm doing some mining. Yeah, and now let's see. Here's a zombie. Oh, yeah, see, there's a zombie. I switch. I press one, as you can see. I'm pressing one, and then I want to switch directly to a pickaxe. Press two. It's really helpful. Now I'm using techets. That's why it's so fast. We're probably gonna start doing videos about uh, about it. So, oh my God! Uh, see, perfect time. Oh, here's a sword. Sword. Let's, ju let's do. Let's what we want to we want to use a shovel. See, here we go. Oh, that's a quick shovel. And let's go back to sword. Let's go hunt some skeletons. Let's go somewhere dark. Here we go. Oh, no skeletons, but spiders. Oh, ow. Damn. Wow. That hurt. Okay. Okay, so we're start we're, you know, uh, starting to play some Tribes Ascend, you know, for our last um, gameplay for this uh, the Razor Nugger uh, interview. Uh, let's see, we're gonna choose a diamond swords. Uh, let's see, Infiltrator. Now, in this game, it doesn't have that many guns, so I can't play that much. So, let's put my gun. There we go. See? Now we got ourselves a tactical strike, but that all the time is shooting. See? This game is a lot of fun, to tell you the truth. But honestly, I stuff like World of War. Wow, someone has a flag. See, I'm switching quickly, easy. If I run out of ammo. So now we have the flag, and uh, thank you for watching. Uh, please subscribe to uh, to our channel. Uh, Gaming Dwarf, uh, and comment and rate, and if you can, favorite, and have a nice day.